Hello friends, in this video we shall learn how to create a table using our py mysql module in a python program. So, how to create a database table? The SQL statement for creating a table is create table. Create table must be followed by the name of the table which you want to create. Okay. And in front of the name of the table, there is a bracket. So, the bracket starts here and goes up to here. Inside which what is there? What is the structure of the table? What are the fields? How many fields are there? What are the names of the fields? And what is the type of data that can be stored into it? So, for instance, here employee table is supposed to contain first name whose type is character care is the what is care what the care is a data type in sql care 20 what is the restriction on the first name field it cannot be null last name care 20 age is integer sex is character 1 because i intend to store you know m or m or f male or female sex and income is the float data type so name of the field and the type are to be given inside the bracket so this is the query okay so i create a string equal to sql equal to this entire query i am given i am giving i want to now execute the, if i execute this query by the execute function the table will be created. But it is possible that the table of the same name might be present in the you know database that we have connected to. So, what you have to do? You have to first ensure that that table is deleted. And for deleting for deleting a particular object in the database, SQL has a query called as drop. So, what is the query to be executed? Drop the table which employee when if exists. So, drop table if exists employee. So, if it is already there it will be first dropped and then a new table will be created. So, put this part of the code into the python script which already which has of course in the beginning the module py mysql the connect function followed by the cursor function the most important part is the execution of the SQL query for creating this is the query to be executed. So, all these functionality is present in the demonstration that I will show in front of you by which after running which I will show that in the MySQL server in the test DB database the employee table is created. Okay, that I shall show you with the help of a demonstration. So, the next exercise in this uh, regard is to create a table through our python program. So, the steps that we saw earlier are more or less the same. First is the import the required module, second is establish the connection. Now, we want to create a table called as employee in the test db database. So, the connection string contains the name of the uh, table uh, rather the database as test db then the next step is to obtain the cursor and then the then execute the command now i i, I showed you earlier that the table is already present em, the, uh, the table named employee is already present so if it is already present you may have to ask to that table to be dropped or deleted so the sql query that you need to you know run to ensure that the table will be uh, table will be newly created you have to execute the sql query called as drop table and then you have to execute the create table query create table employee how many fields are there going to be there first name last name age sex and income and this is of course the syntax according to the sql that is underlying uh, this py mysql so, we are not going, in, go, going into the details of this SQL part. Whatever SQL query is written, 
that will be executed when you say e execute sql sql is the string containing the create table query so this will be executed the table will be created and the connection will be closed okay so this is the code for creating a table okay so we will now run it and see the result so the code is run and it is successfully uh, run in the sense that there is no error message so the table may have been created we shall have to go back uh, to that php my admin to verify whether that table is indeed created or so this is the mysql console this is the test db and this is the employee table this is the structure there is no record as such therefore it is telling me this is an empty result set so but the table is created the earlier table was deleted and the table of the incident to the structure is the same so therefore the same structure is recreated